Welcome to PUBG Mobile 3.4. As part of this update, we've added a new themed mode and improved the game as a whole. Let's explore this new version together. The conflict between the vampires and werewolves has lasted for several millennia, and now you can take part in it as well. Welcome to PUBG Mobile's newest themed mode, Blood Moon Awakening. Allow me to introduce you to the new themed areas, where the werewolves and vampires call home. Let's check them out. The area before us is vampire territory, the Crimson Castle. It has loads of supplies, and you can access the final reward crate sooner through battle. Here, the sky alternates between day and night. Hide in one of the many coffins inside the castle to ambush your enemies. You'll also find the vampire throne there. Legend has it that activating it unleashes an immense and mysterious power. The castle's altar room contains ritual crates that contain rich loot and the activation item for the vampire throne. Additionally, crimson keys can be found throughout the map. Use them to open a portal that will bring you or your teammates straight to the Crimson Castle. Have yourself a blood-sucking adventure. Here, we have before us the ancestral home of the werewolves, the Wolf Settlement. There are various ancient buildings here to explore. This area also alternates between day and night. At night, you can activate a puzzle via the ancestral statue beneath the spirit tree. Find the lost wolf spirits to get the ancestral treasure. Lastly, let's go over the new vehicle in this version, the two-seater animal vehicle, Horse. It can swim and jump, and you can fire from it while mounted. When you're with your team, it can follow allies. It can also be fed and recalled. A horse infected with crimson energy gains an additional double jump ability. Are you ready to explore the land of the supernatural? I look forward to seeing how you fare. Now, you can use the new character transformation mechanic to join the battle as a vampire or a werewolf. First, let's go over the wolf warrior. Use Wolf Salve to turn into a wolf warrior. After transforming, you'll gain a dash ability and the ability to scale walls by jumping. Finally, they have a special howl ability that grants themselves and all nearby allies enhanced movement speed and damage reduction. Next, let's go over the vampiric fiend. Use Blood Oath Extract to become one. After doing so, eliminating an enemy in either human or vampiric fiend form will generate a blood orb. Touch them to quickly restore your health. Vampiric fiends can absorb these orbs from a distance. Right after transforming into a vampire, you'll grow wings and gain the ability to fly. Fly swiftly over short distances or swoop down swiftly to strike a target area, dealing damage and knocking enemies back. Finally, vampiric fiends can fire energy bombs that unleash crimson gas on impact. Players caught within the gas cannot use medical items. Now then, which of these two creatures do you prefer? Get in the game and try it out. In the new version, we've added several new mechanics. Within the Crimson Castle, you'll find the formidable boss, Dracula. Pick up a crimson crystal from the map and crush it to open a crimson rift that will bring you straight to his lair. Dracula has two forms. In his first form, He'll approach his prey swiftly and unleash powerful melee attacks. He may also turn into a bat and teleport beside you. After defeating him in the first phase, he'll enter a frenzied state. Dracula uses various ranged attacks in the frenzied state and also brings out a shield. But fear not, after breaking his shield, he'll take a lot more damage. Get behind cover to evade his ranged attacks. Challenge Dracula now to get amazing rewards. Moving on, we've also spiced up treasure hunting with gargoyle troves and treasure specters. You'll get loads of great rewards from them. Additionally, we've added a banner display mechanic that lets you show off your elimination count after transforming. Let everyone know your achievements in Blood Moon Awakening. In this version's updated classic mode, we added a new dual-wield firearm, the Dual MP7. It equips to the pistol slot, is agile, enjoys a fast rate of fire, but does not support aiming down sights. Likewise, we added a new vehicle, the Hovercraft. It can be operated on land and in water, and is equipped with armored glass that prevents players inside and outside from firing at each other. We've also added the self-AED to classic mode. We hope it adds another layer of tactics. Also, the Crimson Castle Plaza themed map has been added to arena mode. Defeat enemies with your teammates in intense battles like never before. Stay tuned for classic mode update videos to learn more.
With Blood Moon Awakening's arrival, you can now also fight zombies in Metro Royale's Zombie Uprising mode. As a werewolf or vampire, choose from different abilities to thwart the zombie waves. We've also added treasure specters to the Misty Port and Arctic base maps. Defeat them to get great rewards. Furthermore, we've made some room and basic feature updates. Follow Metro Royale announcements for more details. The new version brings the debut of the Maple Courtyard Palace series of home items, along with an event celebrating its launch. New stylish items await you. Don't forget to join the home competition. Unleash your creativity and build your dream home. Stay tuned for home update videos to learn more. Version 3.4 also brings Wonder Season to World of Wonder. Also, we've added a new map template featuring Erangel after a century-long drought. More importantly, vampire and werewolf transformations are now available in World of Wonder. May this bring your World of Wonder creativity to a new level. For more details, stay tuned for World of Wonder news. Plus, Cycle 7 Season 20 has been updated with new tier rewards for both Classic Season and Casual Season. That's it for this overview of the new content available in Blood Moon Awakening. Get ready for the grand supernatural showdown between werewolves and vampires. Winner winner, chicken dinner. See you next time.